What's up guys? So we are here at George Mason University. I'm here with my good friend Tony and uh, we are currently testing out this drone in the rain. We're going to see if it breaks or not. So we're going to wait till the rain dies down a little bit before we take off. But the first flight went really well, handled the rain easily. And um, surprisingly, the drone was pretty, uh, pretty dry. But yeah. I'm gonna show you some footage and then show you guys if anything changes. But we're just getting some, we're getting some running content out here, and uh, this is my man Tony right here. So. What's up? What's up? Breaking out in hives right now as we wait for the rain to settle. All over my hands and legs, feeling pretty fatigued, but um, it's a great day to get better. This is a really unique controller, pretty intuitive. You know, I'm really hoping that nothing gets damaged, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. It's not like downpouring, but I think if you fly for a little bit, definitely will accumulate a decent amount of water, but it's doing good, it's doing good so far. So no complaints. And I've seen people like fly it through some light rain and stuff like that so and nothing's happened these drones are pretty well built this is my first fpv drone and i know it's not one of those like custom builds but for a beginner drone it's super easy to fly and like with all the sensors built into it that's probably the biggest reason why i got it because it had a lot of upgrades i think one of the things that i saw that a lot of people hated from the pre uh, previous version was where the SE card is. So now it's here. It's not like right between where the propellers are. I think that's a huge difference. The sensor is better. And uh, I'm assuming the battery life is better. It flies a little bit better. And the goggles are better. So this is a new version of the goggles, which is pretty neat. So, yeah, we're going to fly off, take off, and let's get started. So it has a really cool feature. If you press the side of your goggles, you can actually see what's in front of you. So now I can kind of see the camera. It's like a magnified version of seeing the real world. Kind of funny, but it's just a nice little safety feature that you have. So we're gonna fly this real quick, get some footage, and hopefully you guys enjoy it.
Oh, oh, oh.